so uh, I'm just going to uh, show the base here and talk a little bit here before I actually uh, do anything with it. This uh, I've cleaned it up. I really like the headstock shape on these and uh, the actual inlay on it is actually pretty nice. Still don't have the exact 100% uh, info on this but I will say this if you I don't think I showed the base full up but this fretboard on this base was black and I started scrubbing it with a toothbrush and the toothbrush went black and it was so caked uh, that I actually had to take even with 100% isopropylene rubbing alcohol I couldn't get the black off the fretboard and I uh, actually had to use a razor blade and scrape it down. So that's what you see here is the, uh, is the fingerboard all scraped down of the crud that was on it, further uh, cleaned up and, uh, and I used a uh, lemon oil on it. It's got actually really nice rosewood on it. Uh, again, the mud bucker uh, gave it a, a polish to kind of help. As you can see, it's, some of the scratches are kind of out of it, but yeah, you can actually read whatever's in front of me, so that's how it's cleaned up. Now, initially, um, when I plugged it in, I just kind of made sure that the volume and tone and everything was being picked up, but uh, I've discovered, as you can hear there, there is a grounding issue apparently not just in the not just in the uh, bridge it looks like but you can hear it even in the pots how bad it is I don't know if that's bad pots or improper grounding so once I'm done talking here I'm just gonna again play around a little bit uh, on the clean setting and then more than likely I'm not sure if it's not tonight maybe tomorrow I'll uh, open it up and try to find where the grounding issue is because uh, otherwise this is actually a pretty nice playing little uh, bass so uh, I'm gonna kill the mic and just play the bass through the uh, stuff See, as you see here, I actually had just turned it fully to zero, and the hum came back. But if I put it here, there's no hum. So I don't know if that's actually, could be a dirty pot too. Either way. Okay, back to the demo. Just going to noodle around, play some stuff, mess around with the volume and volume and tone since there is only one pickup but uh, I have to admit this does have a little bit of a neck dive not as bad as what the Thunderbird had but this actually has a nice bass uh, also another thing I need to probably put new strings on this not sure how old the strings are on this and I lowered the bridge totally as flat as I could because it was about probably another probably about two uh, screwdriver full screwdriver turns high so with that said sorry for the babbling it's been about four minutes now on to the samples and hopefully you enjoy what I just kind of double around and do here we go